yeah I'm excited for the second videos of mine on AWS if you have seen my first video I have shown you guys how to create AWS instance of free tier one as you can see in the screen this is the free tier one you can use it free of cost no need to pay right okay and today I will see how to SSH into this machine and this is Ubuntu machines and you must know how to SSH into it right this is not a Windows machines like you will click with the mouse login right this is Ubuntu machine so you don't know how to SSH you need to learn that all right okay mm. and please uh, check my first videos Maybe, uh, you, it, it might be confusing if you are beginners okay here is the instance we have right to connect it just uh, just right click on the sections and you will get these things connect and you will get all the information you need right if you have seen my first video like during the installations it will ask you to download this key file right key pair you can log in without uh, key pair also but I prefer this one for security reason right um, let's go to the terminal and see I'm logged in this is my local machines and I'm opening my terminals here this is my terminals right who oh, uh, clear um, now let me show you ls this is the file right this is the key file that I need for login normally the syntax of uh, doing SSH is SSH and username at the rate followed by the host name right this is how you do the SSH but here we need something called key file here now the username is Ubuntu okay at the rate now what is the host name let's go back to the other instance this is the public DNS right this is what you need as a host name and the user is Ubuntu by default Ubuntu user is created let me paste that and let's see if I can log in or not see I have successfully logged in but if it's through some error message uh, like if you see this I have not you may say like why I didn't do this because I've already done this you really need to do that okay oh sorry I, I have already logged in here uh, can you see this Ubuntu clear who am I see I'm moving to machine like I've already logged in let me get out again of this machine see I'm logged out of the instance right ls if I do ls al see I've already changed the permission for this so but if it's not then it will show some warning right now let me log in again ssh half an i the file name followed by the username and the dns name right this is how you log in to your fresh new instance can I see this Ta -ta -ra, this is my machines now I can do whatever I want I can turn it into a web server I can install nginx I can install npm and run react or some other javascript related stuffs right now it's a fresh machine for you that is running our Ubuntu operating systems I hope it was clear if you have any comments or doubts please leave the comment below I'll try to you know reply all as far as I, I can and in my uh, another video uh, I'll try to do make these things even more secure like for this instance uh, we can add users right uh, some more users set a username and password so that only those users can log in right there are many things we can do with this instance okay thank you and it was very easy huh okay see you soon